Welcome to the Glenbeck program. Tonight, from California, in fact, we're going to be here all week, unless they surround me with torches and pitchforks. I want to start with a controversial ad that uh, featured Florida quarterback Tim Tebow last night and his mom. Please, if you have children, please usher them out of the room quickly. It was disturbing. It aired during the Super Bowl last night. Naturally, now the National Organization for Women is outraged. Again, remove the children. Plug their ears. In case you missed it, here was that disturbing, disturbing ad. I'm calling my miracle baby. He almost didn't make it into this world. I can remember so many times when I almost lost him. It was so hard. Well, he's all grown up now, and I still worry about his health. You know, with all our family's been through, we have to be tough. Timmy, we're trying to tell our story here. Sorry about that, Mom. Whoa. You see what happened here? Offensive, right? Now has put out a statement that the ad promotes violence against women and, quote, CBS should be ashamed for airing it. <laughs> really? That's all the National Organization of Women could come up with? Really? I, you know, see, I didn't think of the violence with that ad. Maybe you did. I mean, he's a football player. He's pretending to tackle his mom. It's not an evil magic box. It's called television. Now, I want to know if the National Organization of Women um, you know, expects that all football, all, full, all football players in America are going to go brutally attack their mom today for no good reason. But I also like to know if now has come out against this same Super Bowl, different subject. <laughs> Super Bowl, but not a peep out of the National Organization of Women. Why isn't that uh, violence against women? Oh my goodness. It's not just violence against women, it's violence against old women. Why the hate from the National Organization of Women? I'm just asking. Why the hate? Why the hate? 